Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the Live Net TV app to your Fire Stick in 2025. The whole process is pretty easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. And first of all, you will need to get the app called Downloader to your Fire Stick. If you already have Downloader on your device and it is properly set up, then you could actually skip this step. But if you don't have Downloader yet or you are unsure if it is set up correctly, then of course, just follow me. So we go to search on a fire stick, open the search bar and start typing downloader in here. And as you can see, downloader has already popped out for us at the bottom now. You just click on it and here is this orange app, which you need to get to your device. But then after you got downloader, it's not over yet because you still have to set it up. So now in order to actually set up downloader, we need to go to settings by clicking this button with a gear icon and then scroll down and open my fire tv so we open it and now from here you have to turn on the developer options but on some fire sticks and especially on the new fire stick devices the developer options might be hidden by default so if that's the case and you cannot find developer options anywhere then no need to worry because it's pretty easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to start clicking on the middle button on your Egg mode and do it fast. So let's do it. And as you can see, now for me at the bottom, it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it's gonna say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options. Open them, make sure to turn on the ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. And from here, all you have to do is just locate downloader and turn this option on. So what it does, it's gonna allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps, which are only available in your official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we'll do right now. So now we just go back to a list of apps on your device, open it, and here is the downloader, which we got. But before actually using downloader, there is one more thing, which I always recommend doing. And it's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they are not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is a great pricing for us, the users. All you have to do in a VPN app is connect to any server. Let's say you will connect to Sweden right now. And from the moment you connect, all your traffic will be totally encrypted. It means that no one can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, then I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below this video or in a description of this video, you will get three months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use Downloader safely. So we just go back to a list of apps on your Fire Stick, open it, and now it's time to start using the Downloader. So let's open the Downloader application together, and now we'll be using the search bar to enter a code and download the Live Net TV app to your Fire Stick. So the code will be 113553.0. Zero, 05. Once again, 113505. That's the code you have to enter. Then you just click go 
and while it's loading, make sure to subscribe my channel. So you would get even more content about fire sticks. And now the load of the app has started. Usually it does not take long, but of course it all depends on your connection speed. Then just click install and wait a bit until the app gets fully installed. After that, don't click open yet. Instead, it's better to press done because this way you get an option to delete the installation files, which you don't need anymore on your Fire Stick device. So just click on delete and then delete once again. This way you will be able to save yourself some free space on your Fire Stick. And then when you go back to the list of apps near device, here it is. Let's open it together. And now here at the bottom, you will finally find the Live Net TV. So now, first of all, I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote. That's the button with three horizontal lines. Just click on it and then press on move to front. This way, the app will always be at the very top of your application list. And therefore, it will be way easier for you to access the app every time you need it. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble online. And once again, you can use a link below this video to get three months of NordVPN totally for free. So enjoy it all, and today you learned how to download LiveNet TV to a Fire Stick.